So now I do believe that my Dallas Cowboy defense is going to be the best defense in the National Football League, and it starts and finishes with 11 from heaven, my oh Micah, Micah Parsons. So in the end, I need for Micah to grow up a little faster to become even more mature than he did in his second year. And I need to see him start taking over the locker room in ways I don't think Dak is capable of taking over and leading the locker room. Still think Micah has some growing up to do. It's going to have to happen quickly. But I need Micah to become the leader of my Dallas Cowboys that Dak is not capable of being. Simple as that. Look back in NFL history. Is it possible for a team to be led by a defensive player to a championship as the leader of the team? Well, it's possible if the defense is the driving force of the team. So we go back to 85 Bears. Who was the leader of that team? It wasn't Jim McMahon. who was just a pretty good above average quarterback. It was Mike Singletary, the middle linebacker. I look at the New York Giants, the championship Giants. It wasn't Phil Simms, it was Lawrence Taylor who ultimately led those teams because those teams won more with their defense than their offense. The 2000 Ravens definitely won with their defense more than they won with Trent Dilfer and the offense, who was the leader of that team, obviously one of the greatest leaders ever, Ray Lewis. Even the 2002 Tampa Bay Buccaneers, led by my friend Derek Brooks, not by Brad Johnson, by Derek Brooks and another all-time great defense. You can make a case it was the greatest defense ever, Derek often does to me. It can happen. Micah can happen. It's my only hope. I hope you enjoyed that video. You ready for more? Make sure you click that subscribe button for all the exclusive content from The Skip Bayless Show. And don't forget to check out the full episode of the show wherever you get your podcasts by clicking the link in the description.